What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, as you can see, we already started our run. We have a whopping 10 miles this morning, so right now I'm at point eight, and we're sitting at like a 6.30 pace. Let's get into it. Yes, sir. Seven twenty three. Well, pace. Let's go. That's good. Hello. Now that I can finally breathe, I want to just kind of like recap our run. Um, so it was a total of ten miles. Finished in about an hour and 12 minutes, I think, and my pace was a 7.23 average uh, mile pace, so really good, really good. I did a lot better than um, I was expecting, to be completely honest. <clears throat> On long runs like that, I mean, Sydney could tell you, like, I really just, like, I focus and I get so competitive, just like with myself as well to where like I kind of in a way I just kind of like I don't know like what would you say I'm just so like yeah tunnel just vision. like tunnel vision like everything else doesn't matter I'm just like very tunnel vision like I gotta get this done um, and I want to do it you know to the best of my ability so going into it it was very much so that <laughs> and um, yeah I did better than I thought so Mile one, we ran it at a 711. Mile two was a 723. Mile three was 727. Mile four was a 733. Mile five was 732. Mile six, 729. Mile seven, 731. Mile eight, 834. Mile nine, 706. And mile 10 was a 658. Um, I got extremely hyped at like mile eight. Just because of how strong and good I felt um, and I think that's why I ran that last one so so fast just because I was actually really pumped so Sydney and I were headed to the gym gonna get a little bit of a workout in and also gonna jump in the sauna and then today is gonna be more of a chill day just football good food you hang out with friends today? and yeah I think I'm gonna head down um, town a little bit and hang out with some friends watch some football so Possibly. Possibly, <laughs> possibly. We'll see. All right, see you guys later. Jay's looking at a truck right now. I figured I would take a little clip because we have been on the hunt for quite some time for a truck. He likes these, I'm kind of learning, F-250s because he likes the diesel ones. And they're absolutely massive, but he doesn't really like the 2023 ones how they look he likes the 2022 ones and the reason is because it's more of a square in the front <laughs> are you guys proud that I know this then the 2023 is kind of like rounded on the front so there really aren't that many around here to find um, so we've gone to a couple different dealerships in the last couple days but that's what he's looking at right now seeing if he likes this one all right, so something exciting. Uh, Cindy and I, we've been looking for some time now. We're trying to find a truck. I've been wanting a truck for so long. Um, I grew up riding in trucks um, and then in college, I just eventually 
In college, I just eventually got rid of it just because I was traveling back and forth um, from college to back home so much. The gas was just insane. Um, but I always said the next time I got a truck, it would be diesel. And I love the F-250s, the six sevens. I mean, reliable truck, um, strong, they look great. And it's just something I really want. So uh, Sydney and I, we've been looking for some time now. Um, yesterday we went and test drove two and I thought that I was more in love with the white, but after seeing the black and just how it matches, you know, the other cars, um, that we do have, I mean, I just think that I love the black. So this is the one that I'm going to look into tomorrow. They are closed today, but I wanted to drive by and just take a look at this one before meeting with them tomorrow. I mean, it's super clean. So sexy, it looks so good. So good. So yeah, I'm excited about that. And then we also have this option over here. It's like a charcoal gray. Um, now this one's a platinum, which is, you know, top tier with these trucks. This is a Lariat, which is a little, you know, underneath. They basically come with the same options. That Platinum is just, I don't know. I don't really know the, the biggest difference between the two, but this one's extremely nice as well. So just a little update. Hopefully, you know, we find the one here soon. Let's go to the gym. Yeah, looks good. Hi vlog. We only took one clip, but got a good workout in. He did back, clip. I did legs. Bam. The current post-workout lineup. So we do our ISO protein right here, and then I love to add a little bit of collagen. And we have our creme, cream, cream brulee. How do you say it, babe? Creme brulee. I don't know why I didn't know how to say that, but yeah, so mix it up, shake a shake, and then down the hatch. Tastes so good. Sandwich time. Sydney and I, we are having some chicken sandwiches on sourdough. These just came out of the oven. I'm doing just one full piece. And Sydney's gonna do little smaller um, sandwiches. So, gonna put some of this mayo on it. Got some olive oil, got some tomatoes, lettuce, and then there's our chicken. And here is the final product. Wow, beautiful. There's Sydney's three separate ones. And I just did the big one, like I said. We got our chicken, tomatoes, I added the olive oil on, some salt and pepper. Time to dive in. It's currently raining and I'm headed out to go watch some football with some friends. Um, but I'm also, what is it called? Proposing to my groomsmen? Yeah. <laughs> I'm also asking my <laughs> friends that I want to have as groomsmen to be my groomsmen today. So I wanted to show you guys these boxes. So we've got Austin, um, and then you open it up. I did just a little shooter. This is Woodford Reserve, very good. Got a little mild cigar. And then these uh, are pretty funny. I got these off Amazon. She only gave me one thing to pick out for the wedding. Will you be my groomsman? So, <laughs> ha ha ha. All of the, the boxes have those in there, and just something, you know. Something slight, something slight, but I'm planning on hopefully seeing all three of these dudes. A lot of them love to just say that they'll meet me. They'll meet up and watch football, and then they're like, oh. Hey, I'm pretty nervous to propose to you right now. Yeah. I'm nervous, I don't know how to do it. I don't know, I think I'll just try to be funny about it. 
I might actually get on a knee and do it. <laughs> that would be hilarious. That would be so Maybe I'll be able to capture it on camera. We'll see. All right. Crazy. Got something for you, bro. Yeah, bro. What you doing? <laughs> what you say, bro? Will, will you brother. be Will you be a groomsman? I've been waiting on this moment, bro. I've been waiting, bro. <laughs> Oh, we got, what we got? Oh, man. <laughs> of course, bro. Of course, of course. Oh, <laughs> Good morning. It is Monday morning, the next day. The last thing I showed was, I think, me giving the groomsman box to Jamari. Um, after that, it was pouring rain when I did that, so... I just invited Jamari to come over. So he came over and me, Jamari, and Sydney, we all sat on the couch and watched football and just hung out last night. Um, got some goofy pics, so I'm sure I'm gonna try to upload those on here as well so you guys can see. But like I said, it is Monday morning. Um, just to update you guys, I got my programming from my coach. So I know I told you guys that I was jumping on the phone I had a phone call with this coach. Um, we went over a few things and this was the first week that we're starting. So I had my very first workout with him. Um, and this morning I only have three miles, but I have it at such a slow pace. So this is kind of what I was talking about where I need the guidance on learning how to you know, run slower because three miles, I would usually just get out here and just kind of go at a comfortable pace, which would be, you know, a bit, a, a lot faster than what he's wanting me to run. So, um, yeah, this is gonna be new. This is gonna be interesting. Um, I was telling Sydney, it's basically gonna feel like I'm walking because it is like at like a, around a nine minute pace. But you have to run these slow runs slow. I hear that's the key. You gotta trust the process, follow it, listen, and you know, you'll reap the benefits at the end. So. Let's get into this. Um, I'm gonna get this done and then I'll just kind of update you guys after. So I'll see you then. Run is complete. Um, that was the most, that was like the biggest difference um, in a run than what I've been doing. It was very much like a little giddy up the entire time, but it was fun. It was different and um, we stayed the course. We followed it. I think, let me see if I can. So we ran a total of three miles at a 9.16 mile pace and our overall time was 27 minutes, 56 seconds. So felt good. Um, the weather's really nice. It was kind of cold in like the 60s here. Warm, I guess you would say. So um, it was kind of very refreshing compared to our 10 mile run yesterday. So I'm gonna go ahead. Um, eat some food and then get the day started i'm gonna close this vlog out thank you guys for watching um i'm gonna continue to put out more and more so make sure to continue to tune in and subscribe if you aren't already see you guys in the next one bye